Hi! In this tutorial, I will show you how to create 2-in-1 hairstyle for long hair. This is my hairstyle EXO. In this channel, I will show you lots of different crates and hairstyles. Hopefully you will like it. Start creating the Vistel braid. Take a section of hair from the front of your head. Separate the section in two pieces and start to bring small sections over to the another strand. Take a small section from the left side, bring it over and add to the right. Then take the small section from the right, bring it over, add some hair and add both to the left side. Bring the section from the left to the right. Then from right to the left and add some hair. Section from the left to the right. And then again from right over to the left, add some hair. Small section from the left over to the right. Then small section over from the right to the left and add some hair. Small section from the left over to the right and section from the right over to the left. Add hair from the right side. Keep on repeating this pattern. Bring small sections from the both sides over to the another side and add hair every time when you bring the strand from right to the left. If you want to pancake your braids to get some more volume, do it before the securing the braid. When the braid reaches to the back side of the head, stop adding more hair and keep on repeating the same pattern, bringing hair from side over to the middle, few stitches more. Next, I repeat the same to the another side. Before starting, brush the hair with water. Wet hair is easier to braid neatly. Then take the section of hair and separate it in again two pieces. Take small section at a time and bring it over to the another section. Section from the right over to the left. Section from the left over to the right. Add some hair from the left side. Small section from the right over to the left and small section from the left over to the right, add some hair. Section from the right over to the left and from left over to the right, add some hair. So create the similar fistel braid to this side as well, only difference is that you create the braid as a mirror, so add hair from the left side, not from the right side like the previous time. Keep on braiding until you could tie these two braids together. I add, in the end, few stitches more so it's easier to get these braids merged. Next, I will 
open both of these elastics to merge the braids in one braid. Take the left pistol braid, separate the right section of the braid and add to the same section with the right sided section of the right braid. And bring the left section from the right braid to the left braid with left sided section. And that's how you have two sections again merged to braids together. I pull the hair through so it will be tight at the end. Then just start the braid like normally. Bring the strand from the side over to the middle and add to the another section. Small section from the left over to the right and small section from the right over to the left. And here's the final result of this first hairstyle. This half up hairstyle is great for any occasions or just a daily look. Next, I create the braid version of this style. Separate the hair in two pieces and press some water to the hair before starting. Then separate the nether section in three pieces and start the braid, regular three strand braid. Make sure that this braid won't be too far away from the fistel braid. Braid must reach under the fistel braid. Pancake the stitches to create more volume. When the tree strand braid is a little bit longer than the fistel braid, secure the braid with an elastic. Then repeat the same to the another side. Separate the hair piece in three sections and bring the hair from side to the middle. Pancake the edges of this braid. Pinch the hair stitch and pull gently out of the braid. Last but not least, secure two twister braids together under the fistel braid and shape the braid as you like. Then just use the bobby pins to secure the shape you like. And here's the final result of the second hairstyle. Thank you for watching this tutorial, hopefully you like it and I will see you soon again.